coolest tennis tournament in the desert, you're probably thinking Indian Wells. But I'd argue this is the coolest amateur tennis tournament in the world. Welcome to the Low Desert Open at the Courts in Borrego Springs. The Courts is a simple concept. Founded six years ago, it is literally just four tennis courts, a clubhouse, and a pool in the middle of nowhere. However, it's the setting and careful curation of all the details that make this place special. I came in town for the 2024 Low Desert Open, an annual tournament they host. I don't think I was quite prepared for the treat I was about to experience. Not your average gift bag for a tournament. First off, this tote. Sick. I'd pay like 50 bucks for this thing. We start opening. We get some socks, always needed. Kith Wilson wristband, that's huge. Wilson hat, fancy sunscreen, strings. This sick beach towel, I mean, that. And some CBD sports rub. Can't ask for much more here today, this is sick. Player warm up incoming. Never done any sort of tennis drills with other people, like groups. So this should be interesting. The resident instructor and staff coach Yuroslav took us through a slew of group drills. And let me tell you, he was a ball of energy. After that, we played some live ball, and then me and my brother ventured over to a sport we're more familiar with. People don't know that I'm a sniper. Sniper. People want to practice their serves, man? I will take return practice. That's what I need. Just spent like 45 minutes. We gotta get ready for tomorrow. Let's go. This town here reminds me of Radiator Springs. About to get some Carly's pre-game meal. Pre, pre-turny. Yeah. Pre-turny dining. Looks like a vibe. I mean, this town is insane. We're just locked in the middle of all these mountains in the desert. Game day. We got a light drizzle going on, but you know. It's the desert, so I can't imagine that's gonna be a big issue. Something you hate to see when you're going to play tennis. There you go. That's that's just never ideal when you're going out to play, especially in a tournament setting, but I'm from Texas, so the wind is always howling there, so it should be helpful maybe playing against these California people. Playing in an advanced tennis bracket, not an advanced player, but we're gonna make something happen. Fast four format. We definitely aren't gonna be filming the matches in their entirety. It's gonna be more clips and we will check in afterwards, but excited to get back to the venue and just vibe out. We've know? been we've been talking about it all weekend. The goal is one win. The goal is one win. If I can get one win, who knows what my draw is? There's some like nine UTRs in this tournament. Um, so who knows what my draw is? If I can get one win, man, I'll be feeling good, but if I lose today, we're still gonna have a great time watching some tennis, just vibing. Yeah. <laughs> if you're not dressed in your absolutely swaggiest outfit, you have no chance. You have no chance out here because everyone's looking fly as crap. What are you dressed in? You know, I got some. You'll see. You'll see when I head out to the court. I'm giving myself a chance. <laughs> We're starting earlier than expected. I'm not stretched or warm. I guess that's the tennis. You just gotta be ready when the match before you finish. We've got a little bit of rain flow. Trey's got about a seven minute warm up. Unbreakable, that's the thing. Got the Johan chain section over here. Oh, you better be loud. <laughs> Not the start we wanted. <laughs> 
<laughs> it was a tough start serving. Got to make a first serve. We're, we're good. This is not good. <laughs> There we go. I need to hear more from you, bud. <laughs> really? Yeah. All right. Swing through, baby. Here we go now. Here we go now. You see me talk to myself the whole time. <laughs> yeah. All right, we got one. We got one. <laughs> Three more. Stay locked. Stay, Stay locked, locked in. Let's get it. Definitely getting a different level of competitiveness from Trey today. The wind is coming. Unamas, unamas, lock in. Make every return. Make every return. every point the first two games besides double faults that it gave me. I know Kyle was thinking it was, it was over for me. Um, paddle back on the first one 4-2, start off solid with the second one, win that 4-2. You know, we just battled really, just tell myself to get the ball in, serve well. That's kind of what I did. And so we didn't come out here for nothing. We're on round two. Feels good. Okay, starting to build a fan base here. <laughs> I mean, the vibes here are immaculate. Everyone after, after the match is coming up telling me good job, I'm just like, man, this is awesome. This is what tennis should be like. Just everyone's welcome, having a good time, fun atmosphere. Tennis is important, but it's not It's not the main thing. That's that's the key. So, let's, let's get another one. Why don't we just F around and get another one? Unorthodox warm-up strategy, but it's all we got out here. And you know, why not start with something you know, build some confidence, get the blood flowing, just get some shots up. Let's ride. Main court. Make balls. Make balls. That's the word. Down. Who's down? What you gonna do? I'm gonna search. Alright, cool. I'll take this side. Cool. Good luck, man. You too. I need more from your game, Kyle. He's got a little section. It's not blank, you have to do it so far. Oh, my opponents are cooked our top. And I got him in my box. That's it. That's good work. 
Oh. I can't say positive because that's been working, but two bad service games. One down, one to go. All right, we are getting our money's worth. We're on to the semifinals night session. That was a battle in the wind. But the thing about it, I was born in the wind. I was bred by it. That Texas wind has developed me for this kind of tennis. The run is probably over for me as we've, we see a nine UTR next match. But we're just gonna do everything we can, try to make it tough on them, make them uncomfortable, serve big, and you know, we'll see what happens. But we're having fun out here, man. This is, I've done better than I expected, so I feel good. The unfortunate thing, I came into this tournament struggling with some tennis elbow, and now we are really struggling with some tennis elbow. My arm hurts pretty bad. Serves are not going to be as good. <laughs> Working way too hard. <laughs> Fortunately, today is not the day for the semifinal match. We're going to be running it back tomorrow. Apparently, the lights aren't great. We're going to get some food, and we're going to head back to hot tub, decompress the body, and then get a good night's sleep. And then a long day tomorrow, travel day, but we're gonna win the tournament first. Peace. Do it, man. I'm about to get in the hot tub, finish off a great day. Trey's got a big match tomorrow, <laughs> baby. Everybody wants him to win here. Does it get better than this, folks? Is this the greatest amateur tennis tournament in the world? It's gotta be. It's gotta be. <laughs> Last day in Cali, time to shock the world. Match got postponed. There's no wind out here today. No excuses. Playing a good player, just have some fun. My goal is to make him work as hard as possible. And that's about it. And just go enjoy the courts for one more day. It's about all you can do, but I'm excited. Up. Yeah. Cooler setting than this. This is insane. Alright. folks not that I would win this match anyways but I'm in pain I'm just gonna <laughs> rip <laughs> that'll do good for the pain here we go
Here we go. Battle. Let's go. I can't say it right now, but figure something out on the serve. On the outside. What a battle. I was a point away from sending that thing into a tie break, but just couldn't get the job done. Just because my story ended here does not mean the tournament ended here. The women's final was absolutely fantastic. And we got to focus on the real story of this tournament, Jackson Bright, musician out of LA who has one of the most interesting tennis games I've ever seen. Let's hear from him here. Um, how are you feeling about your match today? I feel pretty decent. Body's a little tight, as it should be, you know, loosen it up. Already have my coffee. I'm waiting for that, the thing that happens after a coffee. So, <laughs> the, and, then I'll be, and then I'll be content. I'll be ready to rock. I'm excited for you guys to see this guy's game. You got one of the craziest looking forehands I've ever seen. Um, talk, talk a little bit about that. A lot of people would call it displeasing to the eye. <laughs> and basically, it's a two-handed forehand with the left hands on top. I'm a right-hander. Left hand stays on top. Uh, well, if I had the grip, maybe I'll show it later, the yeah. grip, but I actually can't give all the, all the details on it because it'll give <laughs> away my weaknesses. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I have some glaring weaknesses <laughs> with the two-hander. Uh, what's your like UTR, USTA level? Well, UTR level dropped in two matches, two points. It was terrible. I went okay. from, I think, 11 to a, I'm like, I don't even know, nine something. Jeez. And I was, and the whole thing at the beginning of the year, I was like, okay, get beat a 12, be a 12. And I'm like losing to nines and tens. I'm like, geez, right. yes, you're not who you thought you were. <laughs> Practice, no doubt, I'm a 12, 13, UTR. <laughs> Match time, six to nine, maybe 10 on a good day. I become a different human being. I just become a child on the court. I just baby it, you know, everybody goes to the problems, tight booty, just baby it, get it in, no fluidity. So we'll see if like if that's who shows up today or yeah. you know does the kid want to play. I, I've got confidence in you. You would not believe how much spin he puts on his forehand. Like you're not missing that often on that. No, side. but it, it can spray. That's the sprayer. My, <laughs> my sweetheart's always been the backhand on the line. Really? If I get a backhand on the line today, I'm looking at you with the wind. So <laughs> okay. Be ready for okay. It. okay we'll that move. is my baby, but it's 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 betrayed me this week. I will say okay. that. Okay. All right, man. Good luck yeah. today. Thank you. We're excited to see it. Over Jackson ended up putting on an absolute clinic, just incredibly solid on both sides. And while that forehand looks funny, it sure does go in a lot. There's a winner there. I mean, there was not a lot his opponent could do today. He was just too solid. Um, he just moved too well. His serve is great. Didn't make a lot of double faults, and it was pretty quick work for Jackson today. Um, he promised me three backhands down the line, he got a couple, here's the second, but they just didn't play long enough for him to get all three. They ended up playing some really nice points in front of the whole crowd and none better than this one coming up here. Take a look. So Jackson ended up winning in what capped off a truly extraordinary weekend. Guys, I really can't express how special this was and how excited I am to go back. Thank you to the courts, thank you to everyone who was there, and thank you to all who watched these videos. 
This is the goal. Tell more stories about tennis. Thank y'all for watching. Winners only. Peace.